A new ASEA category, a Series 8, has been launched with even more demanding engine testing than previously. Primarily, the OM471 engine test has really driven up the performance requirements of the latest generation lubricants. It replaced the OM501, which was Euro 5 technology. The main differences between the two engines are down to emissions and fuel efficiency. This engine has been designed to run on lower viscosity oils, so all the internal components now have much, much tighter tolerances. It's a 13-litre engine, and it's fitted in the Mercedes-Benz Actros truck. Compared to other tests in both the ASEA sequences and the API categories, this engine test is very, very severe. The reason for that is the use of Euro 6 hardware. The higher temperatures and pressures in the cylinder, it drives up the temperature of the steel piston. The oil's ability to prevent deposit buildup is now much more paramount. We need much better wear control and also excellent oxidation control. The test duration is much longer. It runs for 600 hours with multiple stop starts. And that puts huge load, very high torque on the boundary conditions of certain components within the engine. At the end of the test, there are 18 parameters that get measured. So not only are we looking at wear, deposit control and the cleanliness, we also have to look at the oil analysis, testing for oxidation and viscosity increase. Poor performing oils can degrade in the ring pack area, sludge formation can start to occur and the oil mist separator efficiency is severely reduced. It's a big challenge for lubricants to pass this test. Lubrizol CV9660 has been specifically designed with the needs of the OM471 in mind. Lubrizol has invested in OM471 appetite studies, looking at how different chemistries and different formulating styles affect the performance. We have the OM471 installed in our test house. So when the engine is dismantled, I get to see firsthand just how well CV9660 has performed. No matter what base oil it's in or what viscosity grade it's at, the deposit control, wear control and the oxidation control is always outstanding. And so we anticipate that the technology will meet the needs of vehicle hardware for a long time to come.